Okay, I've been getting so many questions, and so I thought I would address it. So what is the disorder that my kids have? First, I want to tell you that it's a very rare disorder. It is a recessive disorder, so they had to have a copy from both myself and my husband in order to get this disorder. Second, as I explain it to you, I'm going to give you some terms that you maybe look up and you'll say, well, it's not that rare. That's because those are the bigger umbrellas of the disorder. So it is a genetic disorder. The big umbrella is metabolic. So it's a metabolic disorder. It has to do with the way that their body produces and fuels energy. The next umbrella is something called NKH, non-ketotic hyperglycinemia. There are lots of kids with this disorder. Um, it is the family of disorders that our kids' disorder goes underneath. But as you go down, there's fewer and fewer cases. In fact, if you Google the di actual disorder that they have, you won't even know what to Google and you'll find nothing. So you go to a gene, it's called the LIAS gene. That is where the problem is in their genetics. So they have the rare variant form on the LIAS gene. It's almost like it's so rare that there's actually like not a name for it. I just tell people it's in the family of the umbrella of metabolic, NKH, and then it's the LIAS variant form. So if you do find there is one paper, you're not going to find it easily on Google. There is one study done and there were more than six cases, but they were not the variant form. The variant form of this disorder is much more severe. So what we know about the kids, the six kids, our kids make eight, is that most of them died at 10 days old. Two of them have lived longer and one actually just died that lived in Texas at age nine. If you're watching this, please reach out to me because I want to connect with you. So basically our kids shouldn't even be alive anymore, but they are and they're surprising doctors left and right. You might be wondering, is there anything we can do for the, this disorder? We actually are on a medication right now that sort of mimics your body into ketosis because it's an energy production problem. They think that this may be something that's helpful. But it's never really been done before. It's never really been tested before. In fact, that kid who just died at nine years old in Texas was on this medication and he still died. So that's it. It's in the family of NKH. It's metabolic and it's on the LIAS gene. Let me know what else you want to know about this disorder and I'll try and reply with a video.